Okay, so with us is Pandey Ji, who is the Chief Security Officer and Chief Fire Officer of our hospital, and today he came to us to give a training on the fire extinguishers in the ICU. So I took a moment to share with you all. So basically, three types of fire extinguisher we are using in the hospital or any premises. One is the powder type, which is for the general surface, cardboard, wood fire. Other one is the foam, which is for the oily uh, uh, surfaces, which are usually used in the oil industry, fluids uh, sort of thing. And the third, which is used in the ICU, is the PCO2 fire extinguishers. Usually, that have a large horn type of nozzle there, and uh, it it works on the principle by displacing the oxygen, so that the fire doesn't get the sufficient amount of oxygen, and that's why it get extinguishes. The benefit is no instrument is damaged. uh in the uh, uh, icus and uh, do, uh, there are various types of things there in intensive care so it prevents the damage and also at the t- same time uh, extinguishes the fire but the challenge with it is because co2 works by displacing the oxygen at times it can cause a problem with uh, of asphyxiation secondly uh, it is it is a very high cooling uh, high, high, high cooling temperature so it can be damaging to instruments also and thirdly it creates a white sort of material so the vision is obstructed so this is a newer one advanced version of that which is hfc 236f it has replaced the pco2 fire extinguisher and its full form is hexafluoropropane so this is the benefit is it doesn't work by displacing the oxygen instead it acts by having a chemical reaction and it absorbs the heat so the oxygen is not displaced so chances of asphyxiation are less so it is human friendly secondly the cooling temperature is there because of the heat absorption but it is not that much so that it can damage the instruments thirdly it doesn't create that white sort of material so it doesn't obstruct the um, uh, vision fourthly it is very lighter fifthly the uh, shelf life is very high it's for 5 years like that and and the sixth is it is very ozone friendly it it has zero ozone depletion uh, sort of thing and next is the oh, the this um, nozzle is of normal shell small one not uh, not like the horn one so this is the newer one which has replaced the pco2 fire extinguishers in the icu um thank you pandey ji for training us uh, it's been there in our hospital for a longer period of time but today we got a chance to demonstrate to you check which one you are using in your intensive care get familiar with it and do read more about it thank you thank you